What did you want to be when you were little? A vet. A vet? What were your favourite animals to put down? <laughs> your hair is fantastic. Are you like a hairdresser? It looks so neat. Yeah. What's, what's your vocation? An engineer. An engineer? Holy fucking shit. Yeah, <laughs> fucking STEM. Girls in STEM. Yeah, re... <laughs> re ah, f fuck the power. What do you, what do you engineer? Uh, I sell commercial HVAC you, you sell commercial HVAC equipment. <laughs> Holy shit, you saw those forest fires, you were like, money! <laughs> yeah. yeah! Wow, what's the, what's the highest BTU you go to? <laughs> Come on, you gotta be quicker with that. Two million? Where are you selling two million? Okay, you, you're very bad at your job of selling commercial <laughs> HVAC. Are you, are you also in the HVAC industry? What do you do? A water quality technologist. Holy shit, this is amazing. 50 years ago, it would be like, what do you do? I cook and I clean. And this is, you wouldn't even be here. But now you're selling air conditioners. You're making sure the water's drinkable. Where in New York has the best water quality? You're from Canada. Fucking get them, get them. They started this. Wow, holy shit. So where in Canada has the best water? Or where do you look after the waterfall? Uh, in Manitoba. In Manitoba? That's, that's moose, isn't it? <laughs> moose land. Growing up, though, surely you didn't want to do these jobs, right? This wasn't... <laughs> I want to be a princess. I want to be a teacher. I want to sell HVAC equipment. <laughs> and not be entirely sure about the BTU. <laughs> what did you want to be when you were little? A vet. What were your favourite animals to put down? <laughs> that's what the job is. <laughs> it's, that's why you didn't do it? Yeah. You take the first class like, all right, welcome to vet school, kill this dog. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather just cool it down if that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> you want to be a vet, and what did you want to be? Uh, a writer. A writer? Yeah. Oh, cool. What type of writing? Like a novelist. Oh, you got what's your novel that's inside you? <laughs> it's, gone now. it's gone now. Oh, it's tragic, isn't it? When you see the hope die in the eyes. And now I just work for the man. You're looking over here like these are two, you know, like what, what do you guys do? Uh, finance. Finance, fucking yeah. Bet your parents are well proud of you, right? <laughs> you don't know about that. You don't know about that. What did your parents want you to do? Whatever you wanted. Oh, that, that's, yeah, self-fulfilling. Um, <laughs> but did you want to do finance? Um, a teacher. A teacher. And then you were like, fuck the kids, get the paper. <laughs> get the bag. All right. Cool. And then my, my Ralph Lauren t-shirt wearing dude. Has this already been touched upon? They got nice arms, show them off, you know. What, uh, what's, your, what's your profession? Uh, I work at a hedge fund. You work at a hedge fund? Yeah. Fuck, you could fucking buy me, couldn't you? <laughs> Come to my home, dance with me, Jester. Mm. <laughs> right. And is that what you wanted to be when you were little? You were just like, I just want to be rich. Yeah, well, I'm kid, man. <laughs> when you were a kid, you dreamt about it. Fuck yeah, fucking get your goals, you see? It's, you know, it's nice to know that, you know, women can do whatever jobs they want now, but they still can't get the goals the way <laughs> that the lads can. <laughs> well, um, I, I want to celebrate you guys, you know, whether you're doing the job that you wish you could or the job that you uh, didn't think ever existed. So, uh, Ban, do me a favour. Let's, let's make up a song for these guys. Let's, uh, let's do this. Because, yeah, growing up, I wanted to be a rapper, and I couldn't achieve that goal fully, so I became a comedian who uh, makes up raps about people in the front row. So let's, uh, <laughs> let's do it this way. The fuck is, is this because I did jokes about India? You're like, yeah, whip out the sitar. I like it. Cool. This is cool. Fucking hell. I feel like we should be doing this. <laughs> Is this a terribly, terribly racist thing to do? I... No, if you've seen a Bollywood movie, that's exactly how the dancing goes. Cool, fine. 
with chuckling, feeling cringe at the way that I dance. Girl on the edge of the stage saying finance as a kid. My parents, they didn't care, said pick your dreams like stars from the air. If you want to work in finance, grab your chance. You can do it and fly by the seat of your pants. Make the cash, make it funny. Yeah, you be a legend over here with your hedge fund best friend. He be wanting to get that back when he was a five year old. He was feeling sad like I got no cash, no pocket money. I want to go to a show and see a guy who's funny and say right jokes for me and then perform them. Throwing all the Franklins there with no warning. The Benjamins stacking it so high like Scrooge McDuck, but a much younger guy who's so handsome with the big biceps. Over to the right, maybe I stepped on a minefield in a dangerous area. Talking to some people, it couldn't be scarier. They're from Canada. They set fire to trees and they waft the air down beneath. Let me tell you about this. You're repositioning. You probably got a unit from your air conditioning. Blow it to the south, to the east coast. Burning the trees like these are toast. We need to make sure Americans choke on the smoke, especially that nerdy British bloke. While I rap, you are like, I do HVAC. I can do engineering with that. I don't know the BTU, that's the thermal units. I said two million, you really need to improve it. The training, that's a no braining thing. Over here, look at the joy that you can bring. You're like, yes, front row at the comedy show. I do the Canadian H2O. Make sure that it's pure. You can drink it, no cloudiness, no impurities. It sinks it, filtering in many different ways that I show you the water flows purely in Manitoba. What a very good province, the best you can get. But back in the day, you wanted to be a vet. You had a lust for life, like maybe I can help cats with a kind of lazy eye. I put an eye patch and then Kitty can see nine lives to live. Go on, Kitty, be free. But then you realize basically the cats just die. You are like, no, reassess my life back into HVAC, the HVAC. Wanted to be a writer ever so crazy. Hopefully you'll achieve it. I'm not being funny, but even if you got a best seller, my boy here would still have the most money. You guys are lovely.